Thank you for making our time to join us in our monthly webinar, the April edition, titled Harnessing Automation for Efficient NOC Operations. I'm your speaker for today. By name, 62 says Doe, the lead Unified Network and NOC. I seek your indulgence to work with me as we treat the importance of automating your network operation center for efficient operations and service delivery. These are the focal points we are going to be looking at. Briefly understanding what NOC operation is all about, the overview of the automation implementation, the roles of automation in NOC operations, overcoming common challenges in NOC automation, best practices for maximizing benefits of NOC automation, and the right automated tools and processes for a NOC operation center. So as I earlier said, the NOC, NOC simply means network operation center, which is a physical edifice where all network incidents and traffic of the network are being monitored. There are events being managed, traffic analysis conducted, network configuration control being implemented, port detection and response carried out, diagnosis of troubleshooting is being done, and maintenance of the network being carried out. These are the key critical uh, functions of a network operation center. So having said that, ladies and gentlemen, the basic job of a network operation center, NOC, are divided into two, monitoring and event management. The rest could be network configuration, diagnosis, maintenance, and control of fault detection and response. So having understood what a NOC is and what operates or happens in the NOC, we are going to have a look at the overview of automation technologies. Automation technologies encompasses a wide range of tools and systems, but we are going to mention but a few of them here, meaning some of the areas where automation technologies have been implemented are size the NOC. In IoT, Internet of Things, in robotic process integrations, to integrate capabilities, automating your end-to-end -end business processes. In cognitive automations, in DevOps automation for your continuous delivery in software development in every IT organization. In workflow automation to enable your tasks and documents being automated such that the information is carried out in a seamless and heat free way in your organization. It's also in cloud orchestration. These are some of the wide range of areas where automation tools and systems are being implemented. Now we also look at key areas for automation implementation within your organization and within your network operation center. Dear friends, it's important to know that implementing automation across your organization can lead to a significant improvements in your efficiency, accuracy, and cost effectiveness in the running of that organization. Some of the key areas that requires automation in this modern day is your customer service, in your data entry and processes such that you can process your data and minimize human errors and increase the speed at which data can be processed. In your IT operations, every organization has a global standard practice, has an IT operations center or department. An automation of your IT operations will enable your management to handle tasks such as network monitoring, system updates and security scans. Also in marketing and sales, automation is being implemented, which will help your organization in lead generation and customer segmentation and things like email marketing. Also in financial services, banks, financial institutions, fintech are increasingly keen into automation. And this helps and has been helping them in customer onboarding, in fraud detection, and compliance checks. In supply chains and logistics, automation is also of great importance. 
always improving your supply chain and logistics through use of tools like warehouse robots in your automated sorting systems, in your supply chain and logistics, and also in your inventory management. These are a few areas we can mention here for automation implementation. Now, roles of automation in North operations. We are going to look at the nitty gritty of the roles of automation in your network operation center. And it's important to know that automating your network plays a vital role to enhance efficiency and effectiveness of any knock anywhere in the world. Some of the key areas or key rules or importance of automating your knock are one, fault detection and alerts in your incident response, in performance monitoring, security management, reporting and documentation, and also in scalability and flexibility. I'll quickly explain what all this means in fault detection and alerts, if your knock is automated and you use the right automation tools, you are guaranteed that you can check your network health and automatically detect anomalies or failures of network incidents within your infrastructure. For your network health, you can check which, which links or sites or network elements are down, which ones are up, which ones are underperforming, which ones are performing within the thresholds or which ones are overperforming. This is you checking the network health of your network elements within your NOC. So in fault detection and alerts, automation is guaranteed. In incident response, an automated NOC using the right automation tool guarantees that you can identify incidents in real time and the system can automatically, for example, if a server is down, the system or the server can automatically restart the server or switch traffic to a backup server without any human interference, thereby saving you the minimum time to resolve the MTTR and also helping you to meet your SLE, your service level agreements with your customers. In performance monitoring, every network operation center and every organization be it in telco, in ISP, or in other business organizations, have mechanisms for monitoring and keeping track of their performance. So automating your network operation center guarantees you an effective performance monitoring. And this can help you to adjust configurations or allocate resources dynamically to meet performance criteria. And as we know, there are KPIs what we call key performance index for every IT or telco or, or other telecom organizations. For instance, you have utilizations, you have availability, you have errors, discard, latency, and the rest of them. How do you know when you have network elements or links that are well utilized, performing within the threshold? or the links that are having good availability, 90% and above, or below 90%. Automation of your knock with the right automation tools guarantees you an effective performance monitoring. Also in security management, automated systems can be scanned for vulnerabilities, applying patches and updating security protocols across the network without manual oversight. Having automated your knock or Buying into automating your NOC and other systems within your organization, you are guaranteed you know, that your security management will be top notch. In reporting and documentation, automation will help you in getting your reports and your doc documentation of incidents or events in real time response, in real time reports. You want them in seconds, in minutes, hours, days, or even yearly you get reports as at when due in real time with an automated knock or an automated network infrastructure. You are going to get reports on your network status, your performance metrics, and your security incidents. Also, scalability and flexibility. Automation facilitates the scalability of your network operation center by enabling rapid deployments and integration of new services. What do we mean by this? If you need to have new discoveries, if there are new network elements that need to be discovered after optimization from the field, 
How do you know the new devices that are on board, that have been put on air within your knock? How do you know the new sites that have been put on air? For instance, you have 2,000 sites in your whole network infrastructure, and some new devices came on board, and you're now having 2,200. How do you know those new devices? With the right automation tool like ours in Zoracom, called the mirror solution and the stableness solution, you are guaranteed scalability and flexibility of your network infrastructure and your network operation center. Now we come to overcoming challenges in knock automation. Dear friends, the transition to automation involves several challenges that needs to be carefully managed. And there are several challenges that will be encountered and are always encountered in the process of knock automation. But we are going to deal with only a few of them here such as the resistance to change, there will be resistance to change in the process of knock automation. There will be the problem of the of these systems and workflow. There will be issue of complexity and scalability, issue of cost, issue of technical expertise and security concerns. Briefly explaining this, there are solutions for that. For resistance to change, you need to carry your NOC staff or NOC engineers, be it the FO, front office engineers, or the back office engineers, including the field service engineers, the FSTs. Carry them along from the onset of the automation process. This clear communication will allow them to focus on more strategic work and reduce mundane tasks. Also, training and upskilling of your staffs is also an option which we prefer. The second challenge that can be encountered is integration with existing systems. It's important we know that existing network management systems and softwares can be complex, hence the need for automation. Using the right automation tool guarantees you that your solutions are compatible with existing systems, and this will make them to be adaptable. So working with vendors, your numerous vendors, we have a robust support and customization, which also help the automation tools to be tailored to your specific needs. Another challenge is complexity and scalability. Automated systems can handle various or a variety of network events and can scale as network demands grow. When I mean scale, it can scale up or it can scale down as the business grows. But using or implementing the right automation tool can guarantee that you select the, the tools that will help your machine learning and AI and also help to adapt and improve responses based on historical data. So whatever data you want to check, you want to know the devices that are performing within the threshold of the utilization that are well utilized. Let's say, for instance, Lagos Island. You want to know all the devices in your network, be it yellow network or the red network or whatever network we are using, dear friends, a network operation center will be able to check and will be able to generate a report, automated report, seeing devices that are performing within the threshold of the utilization or availability or devices that are having errors or discards or latencies, as the case may be. And you can check those overperforming, those within the threshold or those not performing within the set threshold. So this is the issue of complexity and scalability and what the automation tool can offer. For costs, there will always be issue and fear of costs because initial setup, licensing and training involves costs. But choosing the right automation tool like what we offer here in Zoracom guarantees that you have what we call cost-effective software solution vis-a-vis -vis our mirror solution. It's an open source to help you, and you can also check the proven track records with our existing customers. For security concerns, automated systems can be targets for cyber attacks, vulnerabilities, or can be exploited at scale. The security concerns, what solution do we provide here for you, ladies and gentlemen? We are sure that with our mirror solution, the automation software complies with industry standards and security practices, which are critical, are also taken into cognizance. So you have no fear because the security architecture is well aligned. For technical expertise, in case you are scared of 
when the automation tool have issues, are you going to get support? We we'll guarantee you that our technical expertise is top notch. We have teams, the on-site team, and even the back-end support for the automation tool. 247, anytime you need us, we have a good team that will help you and your knock to ensure that the automation of your knock is seamless. There are best practices for maximizing benefits of knock automation. There are a lot of them, but we are going to be looking at the nitty gritty of those best practices. And it's important to know that knock automation requires careful planning, implementation, and ongoing management. So the four critical best practices are one, set clear objectives and priorities. Two, start small and scale fast. Three, involve stakeholders from the beginning. And four, which is the most important amongst them all, select the right automation tools. Dear friends, setting clear objectives and priorities guarantees you that your network operation centers will improve the network availability and optimize the resource utilization. For starting small and scaling fast, we employ that you begin with pilot projects or smaller automation initiatives before scaling up. Just like I mentioned about scalability, you start small, then you scale up gradually. This allows you to test automation tools in a controlled environment, thereby identifying possible challenges. Three, involve stakeholders from the beginning. Engage your knock staff and IT teams from the onset so that they will be carried along for identifying automation opportunities within your network infrastructure and within your network operation center, defining requirements and ensuring successful implementation of the automation. Now, selecting the right automation tool. If you select the right automation tool, which we have here, in Zoracom, the mirror solution and the stableness solution, we guarantee you that integration, scalability, vendor support, compatibility with your existing systems are guaranteed and will be seamlessly implemented. Now, this is the mirror solution. It's our automated observability solution for monitoring, visibility, and reporting. When we ask, what is mirror? Like I earlier said, Miro is our automated network and service management solution that offers an end-to-end, E-to-E, observability into your network, net infrastructure, and automates response to prevent hotspots and outright service failure. It's also a vendor agnostic cross technology and cross silo automated network and service management for telcos, for ISPs, data centers, fintech, etc to gain digital value across all touch points. With the mirror solution, you are guaranteed it's a cross-technology and cross-vendor automation. The mirror solution also provides expert remediation. With mirror, your organization gets 100% uptime and performance, which are the hallmark of every organization in their pursuit of excellent, reliable service and quality delivery. Also, Mirror also has additional values, such as in discovery and inventory. Every organization needs to take inventory or stock of their devices, of what they have within the network. Like the example I gave earlier on, you have 2,000 devices within your NOC or within your IT or your ISP organization, and there are new 200 devices making in 2,200. How do you do take inventory? You don't go doing it manually. But with the mirror automation solution, you can discover new devices and also take inventory of those devices. And also in performance management, it can help you in your performance management, knowing devices that are underperforming, devices that are within the performance threshold, and devices that are overperforming. And this will help the organization in taking business and technical decisions. Also in fault management and root cause analysis, the mirror solution is well aligned for global best practices. ROC8 and fault management are critical point, touch points that must be taken to top in every network operation center. And with the mirror solution, you are guaranteed this 100%. Also, in network configuration and change management. You need to configure the network. You need to change 
some network configurations. How do you monitor and implement this and ensure that it's seamless? We have the mirror solution as a ticketing platform. So network configuration and change management is seamless with the mirror solution and is hitch free. It guarantees you service performance, incident management, project implementation, and planned preventive maintenance. So in summary, dear friends, automating your network operations center and your organization as a whole involves implementing tools and processes that shift repetitive day-to-day -day tasks from humans to machines. And by doing so, it simplifies operations and makes your knock more efficient and effective as a monitoring and support engine. Some key points of the automation can enhance knock operations, such as the artificial intelligence for IT operations, AI ops, enhancing core knock processes, addressing your operational challenges and your strategic assets. Dear friends, we employ you to buy in and key into our automation solution, which is the mirror solution, to harness the efficiency of your knock and your organization at large, irrespective of your business needs. And at this juncture, I've come to where we can answer questions and contributions. Thank you for working with me. Thank you for working with Zoracom in attending this April edition of our monthly webinar. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, Mr. Sistos, for that insightful presentation. Now it's time for questions. If you have any questions, drop it in the chat box. Are you okay? We have one here. How can automation be integrated into existing knock workflow and processes without disrupting operation? This is from uh, Stephanie Alfred. Okay, thank you. Uh... Felicia and uh, Ms. Stephanie. Thank you for that question. Like I earlier explained, automation of the NOC or any organization with the right automation tool, you need to engage the right automation tool, which we have here in Zoracom, which is the mirror solution and the stableness solution. Because it's a cross-vendor and a cross-technology solution, which offers the solution to the challenge of scalability and flexibility. With the mirror solution, the existing workflow processes in your organization is compatible with the mirror solution because it's cross-vendor and cross-technology, irrespective of your existing workflow processes. There is compatibility. The issue of compatibility is erased and defeated. And whatever it is that you have laid down before your automation, the mirror solution gets easily compatible with it and gives you the best of service according to your tailored needs. Thank you for that question. Okay, thank you. All right, more questions are coming in. We have another one here. How can automation contribute to the scalability and agility of knock operation in response to changing business needs and technological advancements? Okay, these questions are interwoven. Like I explained earlier, there are some challenges that are encountered in uh, automating the knock for any organization. And scalability and flexibility is one of them. Complying with the existing system is one of them. So these two challenges with the right automation tool, like the mirror solution we offer here, makes it possible for you to be able to scale up or scale down as the business grows. For instance, if in your network operation center you have devices that you want to know their utilization, how well they've been utilized. For instance, if you are in Lagos State or in River State and you have those 2,000 devices, you want to know out of these 2,000 devices how many are performing within the utilization threshold. For instance, say 70% and above. With the right automation tool like ours, the mirror solution, you can get the incident reports, real-time reports, and be able to see devices that are within the threshold of the utilization or your availability, you want to know the availability of the network, 90% and above or 95% and above. So it depends on how the business grows. From the expansion of the network, expansion of the business, 
the mirror solution is guaranteed because you can discover new devices. And those new devices, you can take inventory of them, knowing the device name, knowing the IP address, knowing whatever information you need to know about them. The time, you want the report to come out in minutes, in seconds, in hours, weekly report, in daily report. The right automation tool like the mirror solution guarantees you this. So irrespective of the growth of the business, the mirror solution is very compatible, is cross-technology, is cross-vendor, and is user-friendly. Wow, thank you, Mr. Sisters. Okay, uh, this should be the last one coming in. That question came in from uh, Mr. Chukwe Buka. Okay, we have another one here from uh, Mr. Tomitof, uh, Tebitofe Yistua. What is the role of AI in knock operations? Okay, the role, uh, the, the role of AI, artificial intelligence in knock operations is uh, all encompassing. It helps every knock operation center in their decision-making processes and having an efficient or improve their operational efficiency. It can help them in predictive analysis, in root cause analysis and in other critical touch points. So the AI in knock operations cannot, the importance cannot be overemphasized. With AI, you can predict sites or links that are about to go down. That is where the predictive analysis comes in. It can help in root cause analysis. It can help in incident management. It can help in other touch points that has been mentioned earlier. So AI in knock operations is very critical and is all encompassing. There are a lot of them. If I go into it, we are not going to end this webinar as at scale. So these two key points I mentioned in predictive analysis, in your root cause analysis, in your incident management, AI helps because it's embedded in the, into the automation setup using algorithms. So thank you very much for that question. Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Sisto. Okay, I hope this uh, breakdown answered all your questions and you were able to get something out of it. Okay, if there are no more questions, that brings us to the end of today's webinar. If you have any concern or you want to inquire about the solution that was mentioned, please use our email or you can call the phone number displayed on the screen right now. You can also follow us on our social media platform. We are on LinkedIn, Facebook, and also Twitter. Thank you once again, and do have a wonderful day.